Hi, my name is Cola, and today I'm going to show you how to do a Canva presentation for Zoom without showing your audience or your participants your notes section. Now, before we do anything with Zoom, let's jump in and prepare our Canva presentation. Let's dive in. Now, as you can see, I've opened up my Google Chrome, I've logged into my Canva account, and I've opened up a regular Canva deck. If you pay attention to my mouse over here, what we want to do is you want to navigate to the present option on the top right hand corner of our screen. What we usually do is we click on present and change the type to presenter view. Now, when we click on presenter view, you will be met with these two screens. Your audience window is what we want to be showing in our Zoom shared option. So when this pops up, it gives you an option to enter full screen mode. Click out of that, do not enter into full screen mode. Your audience window is a second window that is given to you by your Google browser. If you navigate back into the main browser, this shows you your presenter window. This presenter window shows you both the presentation as well as your notes section. Hit got it and you'll see it. What I usually do is I prepare so that I can see both my window with my notes, which is my presenter window, and the audience window right next to it. So whichever you prefer, you want to do it on the left hand side, on the right hand side, or have the presenter window on the right hand side and your audience video on the left hand side, it doesn't matter. But the trick is to separate them in two different sides of your screen. At this point, now that it's prepared, they're both separate, we want to head back to Zoom. In your Zoom window, you will see at the bottom of your screen, the share screen feature. It's this one right here. If you look over to my mouse, it's this option here that's in green. Click into share screen and what you'll see is the basic option to share a part of your screen or your whole desktop here on the left hand side. What we wanna do is we wanna move our mouse to the advanced section right beside basic here in the middle and click on portion of screen. Once you've clicked portion of screen, head over to the bottom right corner of your share screen window and click share. What you're met with is this green frame, green that when you touch turns into orange. Click out of every other window that you don't wanna be seen or you don't necessarily want to show anyone and focus on the screen frame. Now this screen frame, you can resize, you can manipulate, you can change the size. And this basically helps you prepare your screen so that whatever is inside is what the audience sees. Now, remember when we've separated our presenter window with our audience window from the presenter view on Canva, this is where that comes in handy. On my screen on the right hand side is my audience window, which is where I've placed this green frame and I've resized it to only fit what's inside the presentation. I did not even include the blank or the black spaces on top and at the bottom of that presentation. This way, all the audience really sees is the presentation tip. Make sure that there's nothing else inside that green frame, because otherwise, whatever is inside, your audience sees. So I make sure that I have enough space outside of that green box in case I want to see, for example, my stickies or some other window, like my chat box. Here's an example. Chat. If you see that chat box, part of that chat box is within that green frame, which means that portion of that chat box is seen by your audience. So make sure there is nothing inside that green frame. And that's it. That's how you share a portion of your screen so that the audience only sees the presentation deck and how you set up so that on your screen, you can also see your notes section without your audience seeing it. I hope that's helped. Thank you. Once again, I'm Cola. I'm a spiritual-led 
systems expert, and I help businesses create automated workflows with ease. One of my favorite wins thus far is closing six figures in sales in 10 weeks. The sales process and delivery process were all supported by automated systems that I created in the back end. If you want to learn how to do this too for your projects or your businesses, click the link to access my free masterclass in the description box of this video. Thanks and see you later.